When I take a piano that's old and decrepit and needs a lot of work and bring it back to life, seeing the customer's uh, reaction when the piano is all redone is just overwhelmingly satisfying for me. That's what it's all about, is, is making the customer happy. Whatever it takes to make them happy, that's, that's my goal. And uh, I've had customers actually get emotional when they've seen their piano finished, actually cry. And to me, that is uh, so touching. It's touching people and changing their lives, and that's what I enjoy about the business so much. If you call in the Blad Piano, you're going to get more than likely myself on the phone, and if you send an email, I'm the one that's going to talk to you. You're not going to get a secretary. You're going to get firsthand uh, information there from myself or my father, and hopefully being able to help you in this really massive decision. What's critical in the sound of the piano is how the, the action mechanism is regulated. If it's not properly regulated, or you could use another term, synchronized, uh, the pianist is not going to be able to get the dynamics out of the piano. You could have two pianos built literally the same year and almost the same week, let's say. And one rebuilder rebuilds it, another rebuilder rebuilds it, and they sound a little different. Why? Well, it has to do with the skill and the adept knowledge that that rebuilder has. So it has a lot to do with who actually is doing the work. I use the best quality parts available, and with that, and with the knowledge that I have, and with the good woods that they use in these old pianos, you know, it's, it's, it's a great, great match. In a nutshell, I, I really try to help understand where the person's coming from and try to match that with what I know we're able to do and know and feel very confident that they're going to get what they want. And I, and I, and I, and I feel that way 100% that I, I'm not going to say something to them that I think that we're not able to perform or able to accomplish. When someone comes to me and they're looking at my website and they see my inventory, or they come here and they see my inventory, most of them are on their side, unfinished, I'll say to them, pick out a piano that you like, and I'll make it any color that you would prefer. I can't expect the customer to be totally committed until the, the piano is completed. You put a third down, and then when it's finished, you can come and look at it, and if it's not exactly the, the way you, you wanted it to look like and the way it's to sound, then the deal is off. With no reservations, I'll give you your deposit back, and I keep the piano. You have nothing to lose, and that's my guarantee. My goal is, is, is to make people happy. I want you to walk into my showroom and lose your breath and say, wow, I can't believe it. Uh, I love it. Again, that gives me all the satisfaction in the world. Another question they'll ask us is, well, I'm from Florida, you're from New Jersey. If the piano gets delivered, you know, if there's any other issues, how are you going to take care of it? So we give a five-year warranty up to a ten-year warranty, depending on the piano that the person has bought or restored. At the end of the day, if someone needs to have any work done to their, their piano, we'll, we'll follow through. No matter what state you're in, if you're California, Florida, Texas, We'll be able to make sure that the piano gets fixed. We'll find people that will take care of the problem. I can't vouch for the, the piano store down the street. Uh, again, the, most of the vintage pianos were handmade, which most new pianos are mass produced. Uh, there are new pianos that are, that are handmade, but they're very, very expensive. So for someone to consider us, number one, you're going to get high quality. You can get a lot of value at a very good price. So that should give you enough motivation to say, okay, I'm in New Jersey, you're in Illinois. Well, now you could save yourself probably 30000 and get the same quality.
bottom line is this, is when I'm done with the piano, how does it sound? There's no way of fooling your ears. If it sounds beautiful, you know that the job was done right and it's a quality piano. That's it.